think this is a blightus. Yes. Boy, I'm getting better at IDing them. So the blightus, they're kind of domed and they have their gills covered. Awesome. So there's a blightus. These are edible. Not sure what variety of blightus. They're also known as bleats. There was another one up here I saw. I don't think this is a blightus. Just curious what it is. No. I don't know what kind this is. But this one is part of my dinner. So this is the pond that I used to swim in. Oh, here's another mushroom. It's this one. It's a little purplish hue. Too old. Wow, it's pretty interesting looking. Too old. Um, so this is the pond that I used to swim in as a kid. And often, well, a few years, I got swimmer's itch here. It used to be bigger. Didn't have as many cattails. There was a lot of frogs and toads and pollywogs and turtles. It was a lot of fun. I enjoyed it. A lot. <clears throat> I was pretty fortunate. My dad had a few hundred acres and it was all wooded. A kid's paradise. Here's some mushrooms. Wow, what are these? These are a tree mushroom that are too hard to eat. Those might be wood ears. And here's some snapping turtle shells. Too bad somebody didn't polyurethane them and save them when they were still good to save. So I just thought I'd show you the blue, the lightest mushroom. 